very few super specialists in the country. These are the facts, these are the facts, these are the truth. There is a big need for not only MBBS doctors, there is a big need for super specialists, specialists and then super specialists. So let us look at the roadmap to becoming a doctor. Usually the Manandak Pillal and Manapillal interest starts in high school because they like science or because of the science teacher, they develop interest in science subject. I develop interest in science subject because of my previous teacher. So we have different reasons to develop interest in the science. Parents might be science teachers, parents might be scientists or already professionals. But Medicals, the roadmap to Dr. Kaul and Kunawalki, sciences Kakunda. If you have little bit basic knowledge in mathematics, it will be very useful to become a good doctor. So, high school on the you should have a little mathematical mind, though we though we focus more on biology, physics, and chemistry. So, in our state, most of the times we move towards after 10th, we move towards intermediate and then 10 plus 1 plus 2 in the central syllabus. So this is two years of very precious time. We all know that and uh, we all, those who have children in this age, we know how important it is to have a uh, dedicated schedule for the children during these two years. Because in two years, they'll either make or break their career towards becoming a, a doctor, medical doctor or dental doctor. If inter pass sign Tarwata, they give Mananda Telsinde, they give NEET exam or MSET exams. And in some states, they have common interest tests. Usually, this is in the month of April, May, every year. And this will what launches them as a medical student or dental student or a professional in the healthcare sector towards becoming a professional in healthcare sector. So, NEET exam, Rasin Pravata, NEET PG exam, NEET undergraduate, NEET undergraduate, UG exam, Rasin Pravata, we all get a rank. Kada. There is an All India rank. It was different state level. There used to be many entrance exams. But now, for the entire country, there is only one exam. That is NEET, undergraduate entrance exam. So, Dantlo Manapoche rank, but then we can get seats into, we can apply for seats into various colleges. So, based on NEET rank, you can apply for MBBS, that is towards becoming a medical doctor. BDS, that is towards becoming a dental doctor. Or you can apply towards Ayush to select those different branches. Dintlo, once you get All India rank AIR, then your counseling starts. In Tamil, it used to be offline counseling. Now it is most of the time it's online. Everything is computerized. You give your rank, you give your choice, and then you get a placement. And there are multiple levels. First round of counseling, multiple rounds of counseling sometimes. And in, in India, we have both the government and private sectors offering these courses. So let us look at simple towards NEET UG preparation. Inter-student secular government, I will, I will just uh, tell the basic things. Those who fall into the open category. Open category, they need to focus on all the physics, chemistry, botany and zoology. And they should aim towards getting more than 600 plus if they want to get into good colleges and more than 550 if they want to get into government colleges and it is better to encourage those intermediate students to be regular in their studies and focus on NCRT based syllabus we are moving to the reservation reservation law because for example if you take different communities Muslim community Christian community we have the privilege of they are getting a seat under reservation category. Reservation category, you say, the cutoff is less. If you get 400 to 500 marks out of 720, then you are you're likely to get a good placement into a good college. So, Ikara, those students who are preparing towards that can aim to get those marks. And they, while Manchi bright students, obviously they can aim for more than 600 for a good rank. But those who are average students also, they can plan their studies in such a way that they can focus on getting a target marks total. So how do you do that? So they should be able to get botany and zoology around 130 to 150 and then in chemistry 100 to 120 and most of the science students don't like physics. 
they are very they think that you know a lot of mathematics so in that they, they aim to get 70 to 100 so your total will fall above 400 and above 400 is a very good mark to get into medical colleges or dental colleges based on the reservation so there are a lot of minority colleges in in our own state muslim colleges are there now so started a christian college in uh, warangal and uh, so we need to have for that we need to have the community certificate and the proper certificates to submit so that we can avail this opportunity of the reservations in various categories so if you look into mbbs last year the cutoff for general category lot general category out of 720 marks the last year cutoff was 620 to 680 and the qualifying mark was 144 out of 720 marks and the, our general state state law the general category law the cutoff was 570 and okay? 570 above us then government college to direct your seat or check out opportunity if you want to aim for top colleges like aims and dipmar and uh, cmc and other national colleges of uh, colleges of national importance then you should be aiming for a very high rank and uh, apart from that there are very good government colleges in various states especially in the capitals cities we have good private colleges and there are some deemed universities so these are the places where we can apply based on our rank and then coming to bds i think last time it was 144 to 686. Mm -hmm. That is, the higher the marks you get, the more chances have you will get into a government college because uh, the the fees, even if it's for B category, it's quite expensive. A category and B category, if it is a private college, it's quite expensive for dental. Then coming to the Ayush, that is, those who are interested. Why why we need to know about Ayush is because now the government is slowly coming towards clubbing together these two courses. Already in Jipmar, at the PG level, it is already integrated allopathy and uh, Ayush. They have integrated and starting a PG course already. So, in Ayush, we have all this Ayurvedic as A for Ayurvedic, Y for Yoga, Yunani, Siddha and Homeopathy. They are also the cutoff is 510 to 530 to get into good government colleges. Now, we will look at We'll be looking to the private colleges where they use these terms A category, B category, and C category. So, if you have a good rank, you directly get into government college. Let us say in our state, suppose somebody gets into get 620 marks. So, you can you can think about applying to directly to Usmania, Gandhi, or open category in ESI or some good medical colleges in our state. But suppose our rank is not good, then we should look into the private colleges. So, private colleges also have allotted seats under government quota. That is, they are called A category. So, this A category students, they need not pay high amounts of fees. So, the A category students in these private colleges pay 60,000 per annum to for their academic uh, fee. So, this A category is government quota in private college. Then we have B category. Some colleges call B category as management quota also. So management quota in MBBS is around 15 lakhs per year. And then in BDS, dental stream, it is 4 to 5 lakhs. And then there is C category. C category is usually, previously that used to be called as NRI category. C category is those who get less rank, more, high rank and less marks. So those people can apply for C category. And in that C category, right now, in our state, it is around 25 lakhs per year. And in dental, it is 10 to 15 lakhs per year. So it is important for us to know this thing. In the content, as students, we should understand what is the capacity of our parents. When a parent's capacity and the can they pay so much money? So that's why it's important that in the two, in the inter, that is the intermediate or the plus one, plus two, the students understand the importance of utilizing the time efficiently to get those good marks so that you can fall into the A category. So if you're if you're not good at you know MCQs or answering questions, so you may not be able to get 600 marks, but you can surely if you can concentrate 
on botany, zoology, and some chapters in chemistry, you can easily score above four or five. By that, you know, you'll be helping your parents a lot because for any middle class family to get 15 lakhs per year is a big amount. My parents say just that day because they want their children to become doctors, who are a couple of years, a couple of years, they they do provide, they do provide, but that comes at a lot of sacrifice and also keep burden on the family and other siblings. Kabati, one humble request to the student center day, you can. It's very easy to score above 400 in our NEET exam. If you just focus on what you're studying, botany, zoology, and chemistry. Chemistry also, chapters where are there, there are no problems. You can easily score above 400. And thereby you can get a good uh, seat in A category in a good college. And also that you can help your parents indirectly by helping them not to pay this 15 lakhs. Otherwise, parents say, man, kunta rante, sare, okay, try jesamu, or NDS try jesamu, mal tarwata, etla, papa, gurum, babu, kura, out, like manchi marks ka, but he, etla, etla, 15 lakhs katte, damani, atram, or atram lo katte, sir. But then, that is 15 lakhs into 5 years. So, the 15 lakhs, it will be 75 lakhs, which I think is a, is a burden on any middle class family. So we should ask God to give us the grace and the guidance during this time, two years, and prayers will definitely help. Then coming to MSET. So NEET is one, and our state, Telangana, has got the MSET exam. Previously, when we were medical students, we were intermediate, this was the way to enter into the MSET. It used to be called as MSET because engineering, agriculture, and medical common entrance test. That's what I have written. But now it is, it is at the state level. Once you get a good rank, or depending on your rank in the MSET, you can apply for B.S. Agriculture, Pharmacy, Nursing, Veterinary, Veterinary Sciences, Physiotherapy and PharmD. I think Dr. Suresh sir will be talking more about this. So we will take another small break. So this scientist was, he's a, he's a scientist, he works in a lab. So in a one evening, he was going back home in a car. Lab lo baga panchesi al he was going back home. Inti kwelta unte car lo atan koka idea hoch. Idea raga na atan inti bola. Malay teri ki lab kele. Teri ki lab kele he worked hard for few weeks. Dan wala inje sirante he developed this technique. Man andar ki tells kada tenth class lo manam chowtam bata. Mana mana genetic material in the cells is called DNA. DNA allowed to na te spiral case la unte man step spiral step sekta kada allowed to structure. Rendu rendu spiral case law. So our rendu to bida dhisi, our rendu to multiply chesi, manam test to chayo chan alo chne pol no unde. Kani nobody was successful. Hindu kante, DNA is a protein. Manam temperature pinch te adhi karabai po. Kabati, but hathar ni kotho manch idea ho chan. Kotho ante while he was driving. Aim idea ho chan da ta ni ki, we will take a bacteria that can work at a low temperatures or high temperatures. So he found a bacteria called Thermus aquaticus. Chase India Sarante, a DNA rendutni, rendu kadiga spiral one together, what the vidadi see, what the multiply chase, in in minutes you can produce thousands of copies. That help us to find out what the DNA is. Now that is the basis of the corona rapid test. Maripuru, accidents, karma, the path, the DNA, one need to test and then, Kodiga DNA, of a few molecules, Nagani, you can multiply it in, into many copies in a very short time because of this technique. And he also got a Nobel Prize. And he is not a medical, he is, this, this scientist, only few of them are medical doctors, many of them are scientists. That means it is not just under science and Nagani, doctor, dentist, Kawala Nedi, a compulsory card. There are so many other things which we can explore. And you can tell us about it. Pancreas, only diabetes, penicillin, x-rays, you can They were discovered by an accident. Accidentally, they were discovered. That's called serendipity. So anyway, now import money. Those who are interested in pure medicine. So what I want to say as the medical medicine, and ma'am will tell about dental this thing, is that medicine law, the human body, human bodies, God has prepared, God has created human bodies in a wonderful way. I am a neurosurgeon, you know, brain operates. 
మన బ్రెయిన్లో ఎన్ని సెల్స్ ఉన్నాయో తెలుసా ఎన్ని కణాలు ఉన్నాయంటే ఎయిటీ సిక్స్ బిలియన్ న్యూరాన్స్ మళ్ళీ ఎన్ని కనెక్షన్స్ అంటే ఒకదానికి ఒకటి ఒక న్యూరాన్కి ఇంకో న్యూరాన్ కనెక్షన్స్ ఏంటంటే హండ్రెడ్ ట్రిలియన్ కనెక్షన్స్ విచ్ ఆర్ వర్కింగ్ మోస్ట్ ఆఫ్ ద టైమ్ టిల్ అవర్ లాస్ట్ కరా అయితే ఇక్కడ ఇక్కడ ఇంపార్టెంట్ థింగ్ ఏంటంటే ఇది ఎందుకు ప్రజెంట్ చేస్తున్నారంటే ఓన్లీ టెన్ పర్సెంట్ వీ నో యాజ్ హ్యూమన్ బీయింగ్స్ వీ నో ఓన్లీ టెన్ పర్సెంట్ ఆఫ్ ద బ్రెయిన్ ఫుల్లీ ఇప్పటి కూడా వీ డోంట్ ఈవెన్ నో వాట్ అదర్ నైంటీ పర్సెంట్ ఆఫ్ ఇట్ హౌ ఇట్ వర్క్స్ నౌ యాజ్ అ టెక్నాలజీ ఇస్ ఎవాల్వింగ్ వీ ఆర్ కమింగ్ టు నో బట్ దెన్ స్టిల్ వీ నో ఓన్లీ లిటిల్ ఆఫ్ బ్రెయిన్ అంటే ఇది ఎందుకు చెప్తున్నారంటే మీరు ఏ ఫీల్డ్ తీసుకున్నా కానీ ఇట్స్ అన్ ఎక్సైటింగ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ ఎక్సైటింగ్ జర్నీ ఎందుకంటే గాడ్ హస్ క్రియేటెడ్ హ్యూమన్ బాడీ విత్ గ్రేట్ కేర్ దేవుడు ది హ్యూమన్ బాడీ చేసిన తర్వాతనే ఇట్ సేస్ దట్ హీ హీ వాజ్ వెరీ హ్యాపీ హీ వాజ్ వెరీ అప్పటిదాకా హీ ఫెల్ట్ ఇట్ వాజ్ గుడ్ ఇట్ వాజ్ గుడ్ ఇట్ వాజ్ బట్ మనుషుని క్రియేట్ చేసిన తర్వాతనే గాడ్ సెట్ ఇట్ ఈస్ వెరీ గుడ్ సో దట్స్ హౌ ఇట్స్ ఇంపార్టెంట్ అండ్ ఆల్సో ఫిట్స్ ఇన్ టు అవర్ వర్స్ గాడ్ హెస్ గివెన్ ఇస్ లైఫ్ అండ్ లైఫ్ ఇన్ అబండెన్స్ సో నా ఎంబీబీఎస్ చేసిన తర్వాత ఏం చేసుకోవచ్చు ఎంబీబీఎస్ చేసిన తర్వాత వీ కెన్ వర్క్ యాజ్ జూనియర్ డాక్టర్స్ లేకపోతే వీ కెన్ టేక్ మేనేజ్మెంట్ డూ అండ్ మేనేజ్ ఎంబీఏ అండ్ గోయింగ్ టు అడ్మిన్స్ ఇన్ హాస్పిటల్స్ దోస్ ఆర్ ఇంట్రెస్టెడ్ లిటిల్ ఫిజిక్స్ అండ్ లిటిల్ మ్యాథమెటికల్ మైండ్ ఉంటే యూ కెన్ అప్లై ఫర్ బయోమెడికల్ సో నౌ సమ్ ఇంజనీరింగ్ కాలేజెస్ ఆర్ గివింగ్ బయోమెడికల్ కోర్సెస్ ఆన్ స్పెసిఫిక్ టర్మ్స్ టు ఎంబీబీఎస్ స్టూడెంట్స్ ఆర్ యూ కెన్ గోయింగ్ టు పబ్లిక్ సర్వీసెస్ IAS and other things. Those of, those of us who do not want to stay in India, don't want to go abroad and explore the options, then you have to apply for some special exam. For example, USMLE exam for USA, PLAP in for UK. After completing MBBS, previously it used to be enough, but now it's not enough because that's only a foundation. Now we need to apply for NEET post-graduation to get into specialty and super specialty. that is another entrance test so specialties means i'll come to that slide specialties means what you do of immediately after mbbs usually they are uh, if it is diploma it is 2 years if it is masters if it is it is 3 years course so there are so many when we used to do when i was a student the options were less ipudu mana deepak john gar cheppar kada sir pa chunnante everything is expanding there are so many new courses now in medicine it is pg the so many things are there for us to choose from once we go to that level and i thought of super special super special lo da memo medical students unna put there used to be only six or eight options but now see how many options are there everything is sub specialized everything is super special you know emergency medicine cardiology avanni man telisina ve cardiology cardiology kavali clinic a clinic chuste trauma hematology oncology endocrinology all those also have become now super specialty courses సూపర్ స్పెషాలిటీ అంటే స్పెషాలిటీ ఆర్ సూపర్ స్పెషాలిటీ చేసిన తర్వాత యూ కెన్ వర్క్ యాజ్ ఎ రిజిస్ట్రార్ యూ కెన్ కన్ యూ కెన్ బీ ఏ కన్సల్టెంట్ ఆర్ యూ కెన్ స్టార్ట్ అ ప్రైవేట్ క్లినిక్ ఫర్ యువర్ సెల్ఫ్ ఆర్ ఇఫ్ యూఆర్ ఇంట్రెస్టెడ్ ఇన్ టీచింగ్ యూ కెన్ జాయిన్ యాజ్ అ ఫ్యాకల్టీ ఇన్ ద మెడికల్ కాలేజెస్ ఆర్ యూ కెన్ డూ ఎంబీఏ అండ్ గోయింగ్ టువర్డ్స్ అడ్మిన్ ఆర్ స్టిల్ యూ కెన్ ఫస్ట్ యూ పబ్లిక్ సర్వీసెస్ ఇఫ్ యూఆర్ ఇంట్రెస్టెడ్ so doctors can also mbbs doctors md doctors or all any bsc msc students can do phd so phd is an option for those who do not like to be associated with patients do not want to be in medical colleges you want to be a pure scientist or your mind is more towards you know research you can after super spe- after specialty masters degree you can go for phd after phd you can choose to be a post doc fellow or a jun- junior scientist and hyderabad is a hub for all those formations manak tell ccmb icmr konni departments cdfd